Hello, I'm the Game Beaver, and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World The Game! Yeah, I'm not- I'm trying not to, like, stretch my voice too much because my throat's really sore. It's weird, like, I don't have a cold, it's just my throat's really sore. I wake up in the morning and like, ah, ah, I can't swallow. Because <laughs> it heights. It heights, I tell you, it heights. So, what do we have to do today? That's right, we have the Hybrid Arena. Uh, where we fight hybrids, I'm imagining. If we click enter, we're fighting raptors. Oh, that is, that is just... Beautiful, you know, you, you just want to fight hybrids and then you get full-on team of raptors. That's fine <laughs> Whatever game, I'm not gonna complain. Uh, I'm sure I'll be fighting some hybrids later So let me just fill up the harbors collect. Oh, oh, we have a carnivore pack Dude, I'm buying it. I'm buying it. Do you remember that episode when I put my password in and then everyone told me about it? Yeah, then were the days <laughs> So here we go, a carnival pack, $7.99, same price as a rare. So what would be excellent to get out of this is a super rare or perhaps a legendary T-Rex. I would love a T-Rex because I don't have one in my park anymore because I spliced it together to make T-Rex. Uh, in in Dominus, in Dominus Rex. Um, I still think the prize you get in this will be the rare. So you'll only get like 500 DNA or 250 bucks if that. Um, so probably a hundred bucks actually. So, come on, legendary! Oh, okay, it's rare. Eh, makes sense. A hundred bucks, yeah. Oh, and who is it, the Lothosaurus? Really? Oh, I won't do that again. Should we, should we see if that was just a fluke? Should we get another one? We'll get one more. And see, um... And see what we get for it. So, that was weird. It was a Dilophosaur on the pack, and we got a Dilophosaur. Um... That's funny because I, I can already make a max Dilophosaur, so that's good. I'm going to have an extra Dilophosaur when something comes out to splice it together. Still a shame that Dilophosaur doesn't spit in this game at all. Come on, legendary! Legendary! Oh, another one? An oh, 300 DNA. Okay, we'll do one more. One more because I'm determined to get that free... Le well, not free legendary. So, so far, this is... 24 pound? Probably 26 pound. Come on, 26 pound. Still haven't paid as much for a legendary pack. Come on! Oh, another rare? Another pack? I've already- Okay, last one. Last one ever. Last one ever I'm doing this. I just want to see. I want- Like, if you guys are tempted to ever spend money, I do hope that I show you the best sort of ways to spend money. So right now, all I've done is win three rares. It's okay. It, I, I, I would expect to get something better. Oh, another rare? Oh, come on! Okay, one more. <laughs> okay, la la that's it. No more. No more. That's it. Don't care if I don't get a legendary now. Come on. Come on. If I can have a legendary, I mean, there's Sukumimus, there's T Rex, there's Ostafricosaurus. Um, that's three. Uh, Demetrodon, that's four. There's only like one super rare, or two super rares at Spinosaur and Velociraptor. It's quite, there's a few commons, actually. There's just Mahjong. Mahjong and Eutheraptor. So there's more chance of getting a rare and a legendary. Come on! Ah, whatever. Nah, nah, it's all rares. I don't care. I don't care what you say. Carnotaur. Damn it! Ugh. So what we're going to do is also, in this episode, make Carnoraptor. Um, I think. Actually, how much DNA do we have? Can we, can we get a level 2 of anything? I think we get a, le a level 20... Stegoceratops, actually. Oh, I got quite close. I wouldn't be tempted to sell any of the dinosaurs. I really wouldn't. Oh, I didn't put anything free in overnight? You fool, thing. You absolute fool. Oh, Ratchasaurus looks nice. Did he, was he always gray? I feel like he was that sort of color. Okay. Um, what should we put in free? We got low. Ah, I just put in Carnotaur. Okay, so... I'm just gonna quickly collect coin. We're gonna collect our free pack. I was gonna say, if that has a rare in, I could have just got a rare for free. Oh, and also, you know what it is, right? I said to Ludia, look, well, I didn't say to Ludia, I made a video complaining about how D there is no way to get DNA. And uh, not only that, somebody posted on their Facebook page, just not being aggressive, just saying, look guys, 
Th this there needs to be a way to fix this because right now it's not as fun to play the game and it got over 100 likes so it just shows the community is like come on we you just we need dna we want to get the dinosaurs and it's already hard enough to just progress so look what happened universal exclusive congratulations enjoy an exclusive gift 250 dna do you think by any chance this is to do with us I think 100% this is to do with us. <laughs> there is no way that, that all of a sudden, ah, here's just 250 DNA. They saw the video. They saw uh, you guys complaining. So there you go. You've won yourselves 250 DNA. That's pretty awesome. I mean, it's not amazing amounts. And they can't just give amazing amounts away. Because remember, we're all different stages. We're all different levels in the game. And if they were to give 20,000 DNA away, yes, myself included, would probably, um spend it on the Indominus, but if you're a beginner and you get 20,000 DNA, wow, that is a crud ton. Oh yeah, we also have Spinosaurs now. We, Spinosaur is back in the park. We can get a level 20 Spinosaur. Um, ooh. Oh, close to getting a banana beak maxed. I think I've got so many of these. Look at all them. That's enough to make another Tuki Toucan. And you need... You need a, a zing, and then we can almost, we can get like that for free almost. We just need zing. Zings, there's always one easy one to get and one hard one, except when it comes to Indominus. Because Indominus is blooming hard. And that's, we can get maxed out that. What are we doing wasting time for? We've got this to do. So, four raptors. Now people, I think I saw in the group were complaining that this is really hard. Um, it's not. When you have aquatics, it's so easy. Um, for instance, let's put in, all you need is one sweeper. You get that one sweeper, you're golden. So we can just put in, I don't know, those two. I mean, they're all right. They're good against them. They're not a bad matchup. And then just whap in Sarkasukas or even Ichthyostega. Done. We won. Because you got to remember, they're half against. So, what we're going to do here again is a mutual tactic. We're going to fodder off these guys. Hopefully, they um, they will go for two here. Yeah, he does go for two. Awesome. I mean, one wouldn't have killed. Actually, it probably would have been better if it went for one. But it didn't. Hey, you can't win them all. Um, so, we go for three now. And we want, we're just saving everything for Ichthyo Stega. Two again. Is he going to go for two? Two will kill us. Goes for two. Plays is actually really clever. Um... I mean, I could have went for block at any point. I could have went for block at any point, but it just sort of knows because it's a bot. It's like, yeah, I'm going to kill it. But thankfully, it's left itself open. So two's going to kill it. Um, can three kill us? 150, 400. No. A full-on three attack from a raptor can't kill a Theo Stega. So we're, we're like at liberties to abuse that fact and just go for four saves. That's right. We think tactical here. So it goes for full-on three. Doesn't kill us. Guess who's left open? That's right, you are. So that's another two to kill it. Now we can't take four. So we gotta go for two blocks. Um, I'm gonna say three just to be safe because they can't kill us with three. They just can't. Um, well, they can't kill us. One attack's not gonna kill us. Two may kill us. I can't, I'm not doing the calculation in my head right now. It would be very close if it doesn't kill us. And there you go, we've won, sword. Was that hard? No. <laughs> but again, of course, it always depends on uh, what sort of creatures you're using. And in this sort of case, Ichthyostega is well OP, even though it's at least a level 40 super res, a level 30 legendary with the uh, meat shield tactic on top of it is just no match. Completely, completely destroyed. Eat the livers of the living. 250. Oh yeah, we get DNA as well. Aha! Oh, okay. Still no hybrid, but three level 40 T-Rexes. Fine game. Fine. I know exactly how to play your game. Uh, again, uh, we're going to go for the same tactic. Um, except for now we need some backup. So, um, we're going to have to go for some aquatics. Um, so we're going to put in Kool-Aid. <laughs> Because Kool-Aid can actually survive a single hit. So that's really good. Um, 
Crown Sutures can survive two hits. And then to finish off with more health and more attacks, Sakusu, because I'm hoping this is enough. Three T-Rexes. Oh my god, at level 40. I wish I had those. I could make another Indominus. I would just buy loads of Raptors. Okay, come on, Kool-Aid. It does have the disadvantage. It still might go for two, though. It goes for one! Oh, oh yeah! Come on, Kool-Aid, you T-Rex killer. Now, there's no point in me attacking here. Again, we're doing the Meteor attack to get in Sarkasukis. The valuable, very valuable points. Um, if we get any leftover extra, we're going to have to save them because Prion Sutures is a lot better than Kool-Aid. So, it goes for two. Oh, we completely block it, which means it has three blocks. Now... Now we have to think carefully. Because it's a bot, it knows how much we save. So if we go for a full-on four, it might block the three. And then we're left open. Um, and then he could probably kill us with one. And then we're not in a good situation. So the only thing for me to do here really is to go for four blocks. See, there you go. We would have been in a bad situation where they could have just gone for anything. Now we're in a great situation because he's only got two. Only got two. Um, so you know what? I'm going to go for it. There you go, Kool-Aid killed the T-Rex! Oh, they got five for the next turn, but Kool-Aid does it! Already we're winning! Oh my god, that's awesome. We're at the same boat right now. We've both got five left for the next turn. And he's probably gonna kill me. Oh, he goes for two, strangely enough, just in case I went for a block. Okay, so he's got three blocks, but I don't care about that. Um, I'm gonna go for four reserve and one block. There you go. Yeah. Oh, six. Five. Oh. It's, yeah, that's enough. So he's got one in block. One in block. Come on, Sarko. You can do it. Right, one in block. So... Right, dead. It's dead. Now we've got to think about what we're coming up against. If, if it doesn't go for that one block, um, we can take two hits. So we have to put in three, just in case he hasn't went for that one block. Oh, he has, which is good, because we're well in the safe. They could not kill us, even if they go for a full-on four attack. But that means that if it doesn't attack this turn... Oh, it does! Yeah, we won. Oh my god, really? Thank god we went for those blocks. Easy. Easy, peasy. Oh, we're going to go for the belly flop. Is it belly flop? Oh, no, it's bite. Oh, I love the belly flop one. Belly flop must be six. It's either six or two to three. I love the belly flop. That's awesome. So there, that's another 250 DNA. Oh, it's almost enough. Almost enough to um to get another Stegoceratops. I'm going to save. I'm saving now for in another Indominus. Because uh, the chances of me getting a T-Rex and a Raptor maxed again is not going to happen in a long time. Hello, Basil. He just sort of walked in here. It's like, where's Whitney? Actually, let's let's see him. Hold on. Basil! There he is. He just he just opened the door, barged in, and was like, where's Whitney? Oh, there's Whitney! Oh, she's gone now. Basil! Hello. Who wants a tickle? Oh my god, I just saw the fight. Okay. A level 40 Indominus Rex. Um, now, you see with this thing, every time I've won with a certain creature, I get that creature in the legendary pack. So I would love, I would absolutely love, and I don't think it's going to happen, but if they made hybrid packs, I could see that being an eventuality. Um, like hybrid legendary, hybrid super rare. I'd love just a hybrid pack. Um, don't make it super expensive, Ludia. Please don't. Please, I mean, I feel like they would have to because there's a chance of getting Indominus. Uh, otherwise, maybe have Legendary Common, Legendary Rare. Though I think so far there's no Legendary Common. I would love that. Um, but level 40 Indominus. I kind of want my Indominus against it. I kind of do. But it has 5,000 health. So that's not a good idea. Um, but we will have Indominus against Indominus. I'm going to put those. There you go. That's the best I can do. So it's got 2,000 attack? Yeah, it can kill everything in one hit. Um, except for Macrobus Sutures. Okay, let's do this. Oh my god. 
It's covered in the blood of his enemies. Okay, so at least we get the privilege of going first. So we know we're gonna get absolutely trounced here. Oh, it doesn't go for the attack. Doesn't, interesting. Well, I'm gonna save. Goes for, oh, wasted it for two blocks. Awesome, it's got two again. Oh, wasted again. What's it doing, man? What are you doing? Silly and Dominus. You're not clever. What are you doing? You've only got four. Still not attacking. Why are you not attacking? Come on. Come on. You've got to tell me why you're not attacking. Please tell me I'm not going to kill you instantly. Okay, six. Four. Goes for full on four. What? Oh, Demetrodon's doing amazingly well. Oh, it's holding its own. It's holding its own. Okay. So he has two. Possibly two for block. So if it has two for block... I think it has two for block. So I'm gonna go for that. Yes! Yes! Come on! Come on! Indominus, kill it! 800. Doesn't make a scratch. Normally that would do a ton of damage. Goes for one. Oh, that's enough. Okay, okay, not good. Indominus versus Indominus. Oh, mine looks way cooler. What are you talking about? Screw you and your spiky, pointy red feathers. Okay. So we took 800 off it. There's a chance now that it could have went for three blocks. If it goes for three blocks, I'm screwed, basically. So what I'm going to have to do is play this tactical. I can't go for full-on attack. I might win. Either I think the situation I'm in right now, I'm good. I think I've won. So I can afford to go for risky here. It did! It did! Right, there's nothing it can do. If it goes for full-on four, we've won. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. Indominus, just attack it! Goes for two. Oh, did Indominus kill it? Did my Indominus kill it? Yeah! Hutch! Hutch! Yeah! Oh, it did! Awesome! And my Indominus kill. Oh, we didn't even need Amphibinator. Beautiful. Okay, that was well deserved. Win it with Indominus. Please, can I win an Indominus? That would be uh, epic. <laughs> okay, if I could win anything in this pack, I would love a T-Rex. Because I haven't, I, I don't have one anymore. I had to sacrifice it for Indominus. I would also love just DNA. Just give me, actually, you know what it is? The, sp the spin wheel, I've won loads of DNA on it. I've won, I won a rare pack the other day on the, on the pinwheel. I also won two 700 DNAs, so that's 1,400. So I think I'd rather just have bad books. Oh, well, there's a book already. Oh, we got a Prion suit just as well, so 500. That's about, what, 10? That's 100 goes on the pinwheel, awesome. And a fountain? A fountain, that shouldn't be allowable. A fountain, something that I won in the legendary pack that costs what, like nothing? Oh, God damn it, okay. What's this? What's this? Evolve any Suchamimus to reach level 21. So I would need four. Oh! Hold your horses! I can do that. How much do I get for that? 25 bucks! Ah, oh, you're awful. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is do the pinwheel. Um, I'll do a pinwheel. Actually, we'll do. We'll finish off with the pinwheel, and then the next episode we'll do Carnoraptor. Because I quite like that this was just showing Indominus versus Indominus. Um... So, <laughs> who do we have? Okay, I'll, I'll tell you how I how I do this. How it seems to work for me. Now, it, sometimes this backfires. It all depends on what they use. If they use... Um, by that, I mean the types of creatures. Like, if you, if you, all of yours are carnivores and they choose all of amphib amphibians, it sucks. Because there's nothing you can do, literally. Even if you do this tactic, there's nothing you can do. So, I, I sort of like mixing it up like that. Having a flying and then a herbivore. And then have your... The one that's really good as a different one. I, I, I understand that everybody has the amount of choice that I have. Because, Jesus, that's a ton of dinosaurs. Um, but. Like. Spinoraptor. Yeah. Put in Spinoraptor. That should be okay. We've got, like, the traffic light again. Red and the green and the amber. So, please, no amphibians. Please. Awesome, we've won. Okay. That's, that's the only problem, because I'm using these first two creatures to be meat shields. And the way this algorithm works 
It takes your total creatures, averages them down, and then um, and then puts in their creatures. That's why they're not real people, because every time I do this, it's always the same. Right, Pelicamimus, you're gonna have to go for your two saves, and then hopefully, yeah. My sp the thing is, it also I think it works on star rating as well. And the way because hybrids have low star ratings, even though they're really good, um, it sort of it doesn't take that into account. Okay. He used two, so he's got nothing left. Two hits, it's dead. Um, a card at all with a what, like 80, 80 attack? Can't kill me with a full on three. So there's no point in me blocking here because it would just be wasted. Oh, it's 104 attack, even. Even with hitting that 400 with a full on three, it's not gonna kill me. And then Pachycephalosaurus has the disadvantage. So that's basically out as soon as it comes in. Can't at all, what can you do? That's right, you're scared, buddy. You're scared? Go for full on three again. Two block, only one in reserve. Go for full on five, do it. Come on, buddy. Come on. You know you want to. Come on, go for full on five. Ah, oh, it didn't, it didn't. Oh, this could be tricky. Um, one, two. It's basically dead in one hit. Right, I'm gonna go for this. That's what I'm gonna go for. Ah, nuts. Okay, so he's got. Oh, he still can't kill me. He's probably gonna go for full on reserve, though. He's not gonna attack. He's gonna go for full on reserve. These the the uh, pinwheel bots are really clever. Really clever. They sort of calculate what you can do with the moves you've got. Oh, so he went for two. So he's got three. Interesting. Interesting. So he could have seven. He could have seven. So what I've got to do here is just go for a full on four. Well, he could have had seven, but he didn't. <laughs> they could have. And if I went for reserves, it could have finished me. Please just attack. Go for four. Please. Please. No. Oh, no. Okay. Um, I'm just going to have to go for this. Is there anything I can do? Yeah, he's got six now. Attack. Come on, go for six. Do it. Please, just six. It's not gonna do it. It's gonna go for reserves. Oh, it did! Okay, it went for four, so it's got two. It's got two in block. Right, Pachycephalosaurus just can't do anything. So, one, two, and a... You know what? We'll block for Pachycephalosaurus just in case. I mean, it, it's not gonna do anything. It's probably gonna have, like... 40 damage? 45, 46 damage, I'd say. Yeah, there's no way with a full-on four it's gonna kill me. Bless it. It knows it doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, but I can't, I mean, you know, I might as well. Even if it goes for full-on four block, it can't kill me. And there you have it. So we're about to see. I'm noticing there's a little pattern. Oh god, almost pulled the tablet off the table. Almost um, there's a pattern on the pinwheel. I'll show you what I mean. It's not in the cards because these are all randomized. But if you look, there's a segment that has the um, the hexagons. It's like, ready? Now, gone. Now, gone. You see that? I don't know what that means. Like, if you click inside that, do you get something good? I like, I don't know. I'm going to click. There you go. I clicked inside it. I clicked inside it. Ah, coin. That's the worst. At least food does something. Coin does nothing for me. Got 63 million of it. God damn it. Okay, if you've enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye Hello, welcome to the video. You've all been waiting for the giveaway of the bad boy Indominus Rex. That's right. It's finally being <laughs> released. Oh, it's, I'm finally getting around to doing it. Um, so, of course, you had to type in on this video, my hybrid would be, and then say what dinosaurs or what sort of dinosaur would be called or what dinosaurs you're going to splice together. And yeah, so we're finally here. There is 1,024 people that uh, put their names in or wrote that specific sentence. I did say that you had to put it like this or else you couldn't be entered. 
because uh, I what I do is I search for it and then I use random.org to generate the, uh, the the winning number. So we're about to go go do it. Good luck to everybody who entered. 1024, I think it was. 1000. Yeah, 1024. So we're about to pick the winner right now. I got my fingers crossed for all of you. 907. Wow, okay. Let's go find it. 970. Oh, 970. Oh, almost there. 970 is PC Nonsense Gaming, whose hybrid would be a Velociraptor and a Pterodactyl. I guess that would be Peck Out Your Clever Girl. So I'm going to message you right now. Of course, thank you to everybody who entered. I can't have everybody win, unfortunately, but again, thank you. And without you, I wouldn't be able to do something like this. And until next time, leave a like if you liked the video, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.